On NBC's Providence in her latest project, a movie called 15 Minutes. She plays an investigative reporter and Robert De Niro's love interest. Thank you very much. Here's Melina Kanka Karini. You know, there are certain mornings when Kanka Karidi is just Kanka Karidi. That, that's what's screwing me up and saying Kanka. It's yes, Kanka Karidi. You're making it more difficult. Exactly. Than it just rolls off my tongue. And there are certain days when I swallow, you know, and I just that's can't okay. get it out. That's that, okay. Look at the camera over here. Is that here. a face? Oh, now, my gosh. Now, I swear, I found a little girl in the audience <laughs> that I thought looked just like you. Look into the camera, oh, she's... miss. Now, oh, there, she's now beautiful. let's see. Now, now, now look. <laughs> now, cut back to Kanka Karidi's. Okay. Catacaridis. <laughs> that is a similarity, isn't there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a split screen. It. Keep looking there. We got a split screen. Absolutely. Absolutely. I've got the eye, Melina. You know you that. Do. Yeah. Anyway, nice to see you. Thank you. Nice to be back. We just had a winner on our show from Ohio, and that's where you're from that's originally. That's where I'm from. We're in Ohio. Well, she was from Brooklyn, Brooklyn. Ohio, outside of oh, Cleveland. Oh, okay. What part Akron. of Ohio are you from? Akron. Akron, oh, Akron. and Cleveland. Yeah, both. Sure. Family on both sides. Family's still there, right? Everybody's and there. And your husband's family as well. And my husband's family is now moving there. My husband just opened a restaurant in Columbus, Ohio. Actually, Powell, Ohio. Columbus. Well, he's a, a chef, right? Yes. Now he's a consultant, but... Yes. Yes. Isn't it crazy? See, every woman should marry a chef. Oh, <laughs> so true. Oh, did, did I, he do and all he the opened cooking? a Greek restaurant. This is too, the first, right? yeah, the first time with a Greek restaurant. It's great. Um, his father and brother are running it, and it's called Tria, which is uh, the number three in Greek, because there's three of them. Three, in uh -huh. yes. yeah, very good. And uh, did he cook for you over the years? Oh, all the time. And when I was pregnant, oh, Kelly. It's uh, a great thing. We must teach your husband to cook. I mean, my husband's a good if cook. If he could stay home, he maybe he would cook. Yeah. <laughs> he can come cook for you. I well, you know, it's really, it's really nice because I've learned to set the table, uh, just an art form. I'm not quite as great as Martha Stewart. You set but the I table can, and he's I in the kitchen so well. killing himself. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Uh, how's your baby doing? She's wonderful. She's nine months old. I can't believe, I can't believe she had a baby nine months ago. Yeah, look at her. You're look. barely pregnant either. You look well, wonderful. Well. Here. <laughs> you you gotta good? go through this. Every time you look, another woman comes out of you, look wonderful, you look great. How's your baby? How's my baby? <laughs> Can't wait to get out of here at 10 o'clock. Anyway, uh, has your baby seen you on television like your baby's going to see you on TV? Yeah, well, you know, it's, it's funny because she watches Providence with me, but the first time that she got excited, like really excited, I just signed a, a deal with NBC, I'm sorry, I've been with NBC, with Maybelline. I'm mm -hmm. going to be their new sp spokesperson. Oh, great. Terrific. And um, I'm very excited. They brought me a cassette tape of the first cut of the commercials that we're doing, and um, it's it's for a, a base called Smooth Results. Really close up, big shot of me, and I put it in the in the VCR. And my daughter's in her little chair that the Walker one. Mm -hmm. She's been going backwards forever. Right. She sees it, and she sees my face really big. She kind of goes like this and walks forward. And I thought, oh my gosh, Peter, she knows it's me. She kind of looked, looked. I'm like, oh my god, this is so exciting. So I said, definitely, if, if it attracts nine month olds, it's going to be a good spot. So we were very excited. <laughs> That's good. Not that we wanted to start wearing makeup this early, no. but that's terrific. I think that's going to be wonderful for you to be seen in that Maybelline spreads. Oh, and well, really she's good so people. beautiful. I mean, oh, yeah. absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. All right, we're going to take a break. We'll come back and we'll talk about how beautiful everybody is in a moment. Still ahead on. Melina Kanakaridi is our guest today from Providence. You'll see it tonight on NBC. And incidentally, her new movie is opening today, yes. 15 minutes. But before we get into all that, yes. did you know several things? Kanakaridi's here was Miss Ohio in the beauty patch of there to go into Miss America, right? Well, I know I was the first runner-up to Miss Ohio. Oh, the runner-up, yes. yes. It was, it was when Oh, I yeah, was... what's she doing now? <laughs> <laughs> You're so funny. Ooh. Those are one of those weird statistics. I, 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 um, I did it my, my freshman year in college as a way to sing more in Columbus. I ended up winning Miss Columbus, which was weird, and then I had to go so, to Miss Ohio. Yeah, I, right. The first one I was like, wow. And did Miss Ohio do anything in the Miss America pageant that year? Um, do you remember? I don't remember. I don't think so, but it was really funny for me, just the whole idea of being even in that whole realm and being named Melina Kanakaridis. It was a pretty big coup for all the Greeks out there. Oh, so sure. <laughs> all the Greeks are jumping up and down. Hey! hey. <laughs> it's our girl. She's going to be Miss America. You know? <laughs> throwing, throwing dishes everywhere. 
<laughs> now, what, what college did you go to? I went to Point Park College in Pittsburgh. In Pittsburgh. And you right. were a member of the synchronized swim team. You must have been quite a swimmer. <laughs> well, that was actually in high school. I did to two years. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> it's, it's my people letting me down again. Um, no, it was wonderful. I, I, I had a great time. And, um, you know, it's, a, it's an interesting thing. I don't know where you guys find these things. But, yes, it's true. But I would imagine, you know, to go into water like that and go through all the synchronized movements takes a lot of practice. It, you know, it's, it's, it's a sport. I think it's really, you're in great shape when you do it. I, I had a blast doing it. Of course, I was 16 and 17 and 18, so it makes a big difference. You need to wear the nose plugs and the, and yeah. the, and the cap, The duck work right? is always the funny part where they're dancing with the, <laughs> yeah. you know, right before they jump in the pool. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's a little unusual, but it, it's, it takes a lot of strength. Oh, sure. But it, it does. does. I, I agree. I, I, I know you're not kidding. All right, 15 minutes, Robert De Niro. Did he tell you how close we are? Well, yeah, you asked me that last time. Yeah, really, we're very um, close. On a regular basis. Now, sometimes, you know, you don't have to be physically close to someone. Sometimes psychically, and that's the way I am with Bob. Bobby, gotcha. I call him. Bobby. Okay. <laughs> well, what's it, what's it like? I mean, suddenly it, you're it's working It's fun to be opposite. that close to him, yeah. <laughs> No, but I, I never... I mean, for Melina, no. yes. working opposite Robert De Niro. And a love interest, yeah, too. Yeah, it was quite exciting. Did you have to kiss him? Yes. On the mouth? Yes. <laughs> and, Your car's just fell. And, you know, I thought about it, I thought about it many me. times. Yeah. yeah. What is it like to kiss him on the mouth? Wonderful. Really? really? No, he's, a, he's a great man. He, we had a, a great time working together. Uh, you know, when you don't know someone, you can make somebody, of course, especially him, as intimidating as you want to in your head. Right. So I was flying here from L.A. I had met the director and writer, director, director, writer, John Hirschfeld, and he said, we want Bob to meet you and approve of you before you, you'll get the job if he thinks you're cool. So I'm like, not only am I going to meet Robert De Niro, but he has to approve of me. Right. How scary is that? And I was supposed to meet him at 4 o'clock. I get ready. I'm in my little power suit playing the reporter and the whole thing. I'm getting into character because I figured if I just get into character, I won't be nervous. Five minutes before I leave, they call me and say he's going to be an hour late. So I go back. And yeah, he was with me that day. Well, I guess he must have been. What were you keeping him yeah, for well, so sorry. long? Sorry, he wanted to be with me. I, yeah, so I, I, I took off my skirt so it wouldn't get wrinkled. Mm -hmm. So there I am sitting in my top and, you know, my jacket's hung up in my skirt and I'm just waiting, going through TV, you know, looking for something to watch because I didn't want to be nervous. Finally, at 7.30. I got a chance to, to meet him, and it was very funny because all my nerves were gone, and it was just, hey, he's a normal guy. He gets caught in traffic like the rest of us. Did you and put your skirt back on? I did. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was nervous, but not that nervous. Of course, I might not have had to audition. It might have been a lot easier. Well, let's take a look at uh, you and, uh, and Bob in action here in 15 minutes, the movie opening okay. today. Here we go. She plays an investigative reporter. He's on besides the truth. You can't talk right now. we got too much to take care of. Come on, John. Give me a break. Excuse me. This is a fire marshal. Here. How's the fire department? Involved? I can't give out any statements right now at this point. I'm sorry. I understand your partner, Leon Jackson, is injured. Is that correct? He was hurt, but not seriously. He'll be fine. Do you have a suspect in custody? Now is not a good time, okay? I think that Jackson was not hurt seriously. That's all I can tell you. All right, all right. Hey, are you all right? Not all right. Time. All right. All right. All right. All right. Not off to a good start. Not off to a good start with Bobby. Yeah. I am so anyway, excited to see this yeah, movie. Things Thank are looking you. up for you, kiddo. Well, 15 Very minutes excited. and Providence all opening today, right? Yeah. Thanks very much, Melinda. You're a dog. Yeah. All right, we're going to uh, get dressed up in our jeans fashion show. Your government is calling this dress down Friday. Get your jeans on and join us. <laughs>